afternoon. How are you? It's all smiles these days for 15-year-old Ashley Lilly when she visits the doctor. Since having a portion of her pancreas removed, she no longer suffers from the pain of pancreatitis. Before the pain was horrifying, and after the surgery's gone through, I don't feel anything. Even better, Ashley won't develop diabetes from having a low-functioning pancreas. That's because she had something called an eyelid cell transplant at the University of Virginia Health System. The procedure lets Ashley continue to make the amount of insulin her body needs. When uh, pancreas tissue is removed, one runs the risk of developing an inadequate amount of insulin production. So in Ashley's case, the pancreas segment was removed, it was then brought to our eyelid isolation laboratory where the eyelid cells were isolated and then those cells were reinfused back into Ashley's liver. Dr. Kenneth Brayman, surgeon and director of the kidney pancreas and eyelid program at UVA, performed Ashley's procedure. It was a first for him and his team of scientists. Ashley's case was significant for the University of Virginia and the state of Virginia in that, uh, to, as far as we know, this was the first eyelid autotransplant that was performed um, in Virginia. But an exciting step, most of all, for Ashley, who wants to use her own experience to help and inspire others. There is seriously hope. That don't be down because people don't think, because you don't think that there is hope. There is hope. I'm Abina Foreman reporting.